it's on a Tesla. So definitely check it out if you're interested. Uh, but we're going to jump into our next topic. So let's see here. So welcome back to the stream. Welcome back to another video. In this next topic, we're going to talk about hardware 4.0. And it looks like another feature just got released with it. And the feature might be uh, something to do with uh, a a feature that most other luxury cars actually have out there and right this something could be uh, like what's called a bird's eye view or or even a uh, 360 camera so we're going to take a look at it and see what we've actually been uh, at least what was actually announced but before we do that you know welcome to the channel my name is Dennis I love talking about Tesla hacking as I like to call it but basically just getting the best Yoni Tesla at the best possible price or just getting really good financing on your Tesla so if you're interested in any of that please hit that subscribe and today's video is actually sponsored by my patreon link down below in the description but more on that later all right so let's take a look at this shout out to reddit this reddit poster chris dh a uh, tesla hardware 4.0 may be capable of bird's eye feature so bird's eye feature, of course, is where you can see from the top down, you can see all around your car. It's also known as 360 camera. And this is the first, first I've heard of it so far. And I think this is if we're what we're alluding to here. So shout out to Not a Tesla app for posting this article and writing this article. I think what they're alluding to here is about all the different cameras that might come with hardware 4.0. And then we saw in our last video, you know, the other day about how there's like a camera in the headlights, there's cameras all over the place but let's see what they actually want to talk about. so the new hardware mainboard will accept up to 12 cameras with one of them labeled as a spare tesla currently uses nine cameras as its current hardware and is expected to reduce the front facing camera by one based on this information the labels on the camera connectors it appears that tesla will include three additional cameras with full self-driving hardware 4.0 so that'd be sick like if you know this is the one i mean there's there's plenty of luxury features that uh, tesla doesn't have right like compared to other other luxury car manufacturers like maybe uh uss sensors parking sensors like uh, even like hondas have it and stuff like that but a lot of vehicles don't have this bird eye feature as well or at least this tesla doesn't have the bird eye feature or a 36 camera which a lot a ton of luxury vehicles have this so this will be really cool to see if this actually comes out for the tesla model 3 y s and x because it's a long long way to feature i mean we do have you know the, the fsd or the driving visualization like right here in the top right corner we do have that and that kind of gives you a bird eye view so you don't hit something but you know it's something about and there's something about just seeing it hand, firsthand with your eyes on like a camera what you're actually you know might be able to hit is a lot better at the end of the day so let me know your thoughts do you think a bird's eye view or do, would you want a bird's eye view 360 camera for your tesla model 3 model y and I, i'm pretty i'm pretty sure i would know what the answer is it's a a for sure but uh we're gonna jump into our next topic and of course we'll get to the live stream questions in chat as well after we run through these topics, but uh, this video is actually sponsored by my Patreon link. Down below in the description, there's a Patreon link if you want to support the channel, and there's a variety of benefits, so definitely check it out if you 